Hey friends, let's do High Enough Guitar Lesson by Damn Yankees. I'll talk you through all the guitar parts and do the solo at the end, all with on-screen tab and chord charts to make it easier to follow along. So let me play the intro, then we'll break it down. first verse there we're just starting on an A sus2 so exactly the same as the A but just make the B string open and our strumming pattern is down 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 up up down 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 up and that's one bar there so we do the A sus2 for two bars then we're going to this F sharp minor 11 4 so we're just playing fourth on the A and the D Second on the G, open B and E there, and two bars. E sus4, just for a bar. E for a bar. And then go to D sus2, we're going to do that for one bar plus another three counts, and on the four we're going to go to E. So. Then we just repeat that again, A sus2, two, two bars. F sharp minor 11, 4. E sus4, one bar. E for a bar. Back to D sus2, but just for one bar this time, and then the heavy guitar kicks in. And that's our verse there. Now let's have a look at our pre chorus. Let me play that for you. <laughs> So we're just starting on the D power chord. We're gonna do palm muting down and then down, up, down. So, and then we do two more palm mutes and then off. And we just play the D power chord there. So. Then we go to the E power chord. We're gonna do palm mutes for two. Play the open, two more palm mutes on the open E, and then play the E power chord. So. Then just come up to the G power chord, back to the F power chord, and then play G, A, back to F, to G, and then do a build up on the A power chord to so one and two and three and and a slide there to get us into the chorus. Before we go on, if you enjoy the lesson, please like and subscribe and say good day in the comments. We have new songs and lessons every week. You can also make a small donation on my Patreon page to help keep the channel going. So let's get back into it. starting with two D power chords, then go to an A power chord, to a B, and then we do a slide, and then on the E string, third fret, second fret, and play an E minor, and then play second fret D, open G, open B, go back to the D string, second fret, slide to the fourth, open G, 
then back to the D string, four, slide back to two, pull off to open, and then second fret on the A, so. Then just a G, to an A, then we've got a little fill, open A string, second fret A string, and back to the Ds again, two times. And then we've got this A over C sharp instead of the A here. So fourth fret on the A string, second fret on the D and the G. And then the B. Slide again, and we do the rest the same. Three, two, P minor, two, O, O, our little fill. And then just finish on the G power chord. And that's our first chorus there. Then from there, we're just going back to the verse, the acoustic guitar again, our A sus two for two bars. F sharp minor 11, two bars, E sus 4 for a bar, E for a bar, and then our D sus 2 for a bar. So we're only playing the bottom line of the verse there. From there we go back to the pre-chorus, play that exactly the same, and then we go back to the chorus again. The only difference here is on the G, we go back to the A there to finish it off like the first part of the chorus says. So that's second part of the chorus. And to the A there. Then we're into the bridge, so let me play that, then we'll break it down. Starting on this B power chord, play it open, two par mute, open again, two par mute, open, two par mute, open. Then play the A power chord up to a D, open, two par mute on the A string there, open, two par mute again on the A string, and then back to the A power chord there, and we just do that four times for our bridge. And there's a second guitar doing a little lead thing and we'll cover that at the end with the solo as well. Then we have our solo rhythm, so let me play that for you and like we said, we'll do the solo at the end. And we just do that two times. So we just have an E power chord to a B to the C sharp a string play second fret open to an F sharp power chord to the A to the B and do that two times there and it's our solo rhythm. Then we have our next pre-chorus, let me play that for you. just moved all up a tone here, so we've got the G to an A, back to the G, and then A, B, back to the G power chord, to the A power chord, and then do a build up on the B, so we're going to do a 1 and 2 and 3 and 4, and on the 4 and play the 3rd fret B, and then go to the A power chord and build up 1 and 2 and 3 and and that's our pre-chorus C. Then we have our last chorus, let me play that for you. we played before but play it through two times so we have the little build up for the solo so let me play that for you so we're just doing B string 10 slide to 12 play 12 again and then 11 G 12B, and then 12B again, 11G, 
and then do 14, pull off to 12 on the B, back to 11, G, do that again, 14, 12, 11, then jump back to 10 on the B, and then we're doing 12, pull off to 10 on the B, 10 B, 11 G, 10 B, and then 10 B, 11 G, and then to finish that off, do 12, pull off to 10 on the B, 11 G, and do that again, 12, pull off to 10, 11, and finish on the 10 B there. And we repeat that through four times. And that's our little build up before the solo. Now let me play the solo for you, then we'll break it down. So we're going to start with a bend on the 12th fret on the B. Then do a quick 12, pull off to 9. And then just play 12 B. Then jump to the E string, 9, hammer on to 12, pull off to 9. B, 9, 12. And then do 9, hammer on to 12, pull off to 9. 11 G, 9 G, to the D, 11. Back to G, 9, and do a bend on 11. Then we're jumping to 15 on the B string, do a bend, and then play it again, a release a bend, 12B, jump to the G string, 14, do a bend on 12, back to 14, jump to the B string, 15, bend, E, 12B, 12, do a bend on 15 on the B, bend, pull off to 12. 12G and then do a bend on 14. G there, so slow. Then we're jumping to the E string. 12th fret to a bend. Play 12. Now 9, hammer on to 12, pull off to 9 on the E. B, 12, 9. Jump to G, 11, do a bend. Back to B, 9, G, 9, and then a bend again on 11, G. So. And then we just bend again on the 11, G. 9 on the G, two bends on 11. Back to 9. And then to finish the solo off, we have a bend on 15 on the B. E, 12, B, 12, do 15, pull off to 12 on B, and then G, 14, 12, and do a bend on 14 to finish off there. And that's the whole solo. And then the last chorus, he also does these harmonics. So we just got the fifth fret on the B string, and use your bar to come in, and he does that twice there. And they're all the guitar parts. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed High Enough Guitar Listen. Don't forget to like and subscribe and hit the notification bell and I'll see you soon.